also, I'm a white person. A lot of people have seen my photographs, they know that. I'm also a hairy white person because of my father's lineage and what he looked like, and that. I have valued myself for the fact that I represent my late father, Willis, and I don't have to tell you anything else about him other than the fact that he was a lieutenant colonel in the Air Force. Now what that means to a policeman who knows his law is that maritime law now applies to him in his brawl. But what I can say to the black community is that I am remotely curious. You've gone through all this history, you've gone through all this heritage, and yet you still deface property in your rage. But apparently white people aren't allowed to have rage. And white people aren't allowed to have anger when you sexualize their bodies, dehumanize them, and pass around gossip in a community like a little girl. But what I'm asking you, Mr. Sheriff, is who the fuck gave you the right to undress me? Who the fuck gave you the right to rape me? Who the fuck gave you the right to tie my beard in a knot and shave my head in a community jail? Who the fuck gave you the right to do that, Jimmy? Who the fuck gave you the right to do that, Joshua? Who the fuck gave you the right to do that, Mr. Lackis and Stinson and all the fucking people who like Anselm and whatnot? You see, you can pretend that you're respectful. You can pretend like you're regardful. You can even pretend like Lieutenant and Major Blankton were thinking about me. And maybe they were, but you dehumanized me and you demoralized him and you disregarded his rank. So at this time, I'm telling you in America, who the fuck are you? If you're a black person, what are you representing? Who the fuck do you represent? Did you fuck your life by not continuing school? Did you screw your life by not working hard to make yourself enough living that you could go back to college? Did you refuse the abilities of God? Did you dis disregard your heritage? Did you respect disregard the blood that's been shed by the stupid-ass white supremacists that have wished you all dead? Did you fucking do that? Because what you've done now is created a slave game. And your slave game of human trade and your slave game of gossip and your slave game of I'm going to abuse you in the night because I'm a fucking coward has proven who you are to me. But if you don't like that association, if you're a big businessman, if you're a big wig uh, entertainer, if you're a big wig person representing the black community, look at all the shit you have to complete, completely clean up. Because no matter how hard you work and no matter how high you rise, there's always some person at the lower level that doesn't get their humanity, that doesn't get their heritage that feels they're entitled to do things to white people and do things to other people that are inhuman. And that's on you, not me.